everyone. Praise the Lord. Very good morning. I'm happy that God has brought us together to meditate His wonderful word. May God speak to us today's meditation is from the book of Acts chapter 8 verse 35. Then Philip began with that very passage of scripture and told him the good news about Jesus. Now the Ethiopian has called in uh, Philip to explain to him and he asked what are you reading and uh, the passage he read was about the prophecy of Jesus. So then Philip began to speak about Jesus. It was the Old Testament. It was the book of Isaiah, but he spoke about Jesus. My dear brothers and sisters, we can still speak about Jesus even when we are reading from the Old Testament. I have heard so many preachers say that uh, we don't need uh, Old Testament because there is no Jesus. We are in the New Testament. Uh, old Covenant is gone. We are in the New Covenant. So read from the Old New Testament. Don't read from the Old Testament. They don't preach from Old Testament. My dear brothers and sisters, if you take any book from the Bible, you can still speak about Jesus because Father, Son and the Holy Spirit is present from Genesis to Revelation. They are everywhere. If you take any book, take any book from the Bible, even when they, the New Testament was not available, they don't have New Testament. They don't have Old Testament either because they have only the book of Isaiah and the Torah the first five books of the Bible they don't have they have the uh, law of God so they don't have all these things like we have uh, the structural one but yet they were able to speak about Jesus because Jesus is present everywhere it doesn't matter which book you are taking you can still speak about Jesus that is the wonder of the Bible that is a marvelous thing about the Bible from anywhere you can speak about Jesus. Amen.